Hey, Vsauce, Etika here. What do the following three images all have in common? I bet you didn't see that shit coming. Imagine my own surprise seeing an official Nintendo news outlet discussing a porn star being involved in their latest game on the Japanese eShop. I don't know whose decision it was or who spearheaded the idea of the Switch being region free, but whoever it is, I could kiss that individual right now. But thanks to their work, it seems like I don't even have to. This puts me back in mind of when Nintendo worked with Playboy to promote Splatoon and Bayonetta. I mean, the latter I can make more sense with, but I mean Splatoon, but then again, you're splatting, aren't you? Who's to say Nintendo doesn't work with bad boys? I and mean, listen, you got the baddest boy of them all right here in front of you. This news goes right up my alley, and it might go up one of y'all niggas as if you were into that shit. I mean, no judgment here. This game features an adult model. That's a porn star, nigga. A person person who gets fucked and sucked off for a living, Eri Kitami? Look, I don't know of her, I'm not necessarily a huge porn connoisseur in Japanese, you know, I, I got my favorites here and there, I like me a little bit of Hitomi Tanaka, I like me a little bit of Riko Kusaka, you know, just a few favorites of mine, don't go looking those up children, you know, that, that's not meant for you right now. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> There's no children here. At least in my knowledge, this is an 18 plus channel, nigga. And by the way, shout out to all the Joy-Con boys that are in the comment section of this post on Twitter. In Japan today, meaning you can get this as we speak. Dogs, you better have a Japanese eShop account set up by now. And if you don't, what's wrong with you? Shin den ai. Nani ga hoshi no? I know what nani means. What the fuck is a hoshi? And it can be purchased for only 500 yen. Isn't that like five bucks US? This is looking like a day one pickup to me. These deals in Japan just can't be beat. Ain't gonna be beat like my meat's about to be. This interactive title. <laughs> We're never gonna get through the damn article. Previously released on Android, I bet I could see the reason why, nigga. The touchscreen interaction is gonna be next gen status. <laughs> I'm about to touch the fuck out of my screen with my dick. I'm so sorry that I have to subject all of you guys to this shit, but you knew what you were signing up for when you hit the subscribe button. This is supposedly acting as a promotional tool for the porn star too. It's funny, I bought up Hitomi Tanaka as one of my favorite Jav stars earlier, and she's actually a Nintendo Switch player too, technically a Joy-Con girl. Is this about to be a new wave out here? Porn stars themselves jumping on the train wag. Well, listen, man, if you guys want to get a ticket, trust me, y'all can get it. I'll hand it out to you, baby. I don't know what the fuck kind of a game this is even going to play as. What kind of possibilities could there be in a game which features a porn star to promote her work like what what else is it gonna be nigga we're just gonna be seeing ass and titties in this game it has to be how else are you going to promote someone whose line of business is this is she gonna be talking about her favorite books to read and stuff not that we wouldn't care if she does but i mean that's not necessarily the crux of her work unless she's getting a scene done in a classroom you know but then again that's standard in japan you know i shouldn't even be surprised they got a whole lot about there's a whole lot of different ways they can promote her products hey daisuke this nigga daisuke this <laughs> You have a selection of costumed lady contacts, each played by Kitami. You can choose to call up whoever you're feeling, whether it's the sexy teacher or maid or cosplayer, so on and so forth. Depending on how you respond to that big question, what do you want? They might text you a picture or a video. There are apparently more than 150 of these texts, which I can only assume get progressively racier. Are you kidding me? Nigga, I can, the Switch is gonna be sending me nudes on the go? Bro, so I turn my switch on, you got a notification, nigga. <laughs> See some ass and titties right there on the home screen. For five yen? Nigga, this deal is better than most porn sites. I don't even, bro, the switch doesn't even, I don't even need to look a porn store. I'm fucked up right now. And there's also DLC where three bucks each gets you a new character that she plays in the game. And they have to, and they have the nerve to say at the end of this, bitch, don't count on this one leaving Japan. As if it matters, my boy. We are region Free dogs. This is one that deserves to be played on stream. I don't even. I don't even know, man. I, Google Translate's gonna do this shit on the go, man. It ain't gonna be like when we played Senran Kagura. No, my nigga. We are about to experience this on a whole nother level. I mean, hold on a second. Let's let's look at some of these screenshots, nigga. What the fuck? It's straight up her calling you. What kind of is is this game? You can have phone sex, my nigga. And look at all these scenarios, bro. 
There's a there's a fucking list of this shit. There's over 150 different kinds of text messages that you can get sent, and it could vary from pictures or videos. This is why I love Nintendo so much, especially in 2018. Right now, they're at the forefront of technology and entertainment, my friends. What other company do you know is going to provide an experience like this for anybody to play around the world, regardless of where you live? This 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 breaks the boundaries, and I'm about to break something else alongside with it, my boy. <laughs> oh God, how many fucking sex jokes can I make in one video? Video. Let's change the topic to something a little less raunchy so I can maintain the 10 female viewers that I have left on this channel as it is. Maybe something chill like Pokemon. Pokemon! Pokemon! Pokemon with the pokey and the man in the thing with the guy comes out of the thing and he likes to fall out of that! Who's still playing Pokemon actively right now or kind of like feeling the sun and moon hype currently? No one? Okay, a couple of hands, but you know what? Your, your opinions are irrelevant here. Fuck Pokemon. <laughs> I'm kidding. That's obviously a fucking joke. But this new game for the Switch, though, I got a couple of high hopes. There's a couple of leaks, blah, blah, blah. You can ride Pokemon again. Pokemon might be following you again. And you can run into Pokemon for wild battle encounters. Great. Keep it going. Move it on, nigga. Nothing to see here. There's supposed to be a direct yesterday. I don't fuck. You see what, like, like, oh, like uh, this, this leak stuff, man. There's got to be some actual effort put into it if you want me to cover it for more than 10 seconds on this bitch. Anyways, next topic. Shovel Knight was rumored by Daka Cupcakes, a.k.a. Liam Robertson, to be a character 100% back in 2014. And that did not happen. He got a lot of shit for it. But we know the reasons why it turned out to be this son of a bitch who actually leaked that to him in the first place he saw the amiibo and there were only smash ones around at the time so he was like oh shovel knight must be in the game then he's a he's an amiibo too the only smash related and so he got his ass burned but the problem is that liam didn't out him so liam caught all the heat instead i felt the need to correct this since i was one of the people that was stomping liam out back then he kind of caught a lot of blows for the shit so an apology from me my friend and ryan brown you're one of the worst friends ever how could you let him take a fall like that but you know what Friends, that's what friends do, isn't it? And thanks to CND making me aware of it, there's some website, random place I never heard of, that made a list of the top 40 Nintendo-based YouTubers on the platform, and I'm featured on that bitch. As a matter of fact, specifically number six, CND, he's like number eight or something. Who gives a fuck about CND, right? I'm kidding. He's my boy, obviously. I know he can take the jokes, so that's why I give him to him. There's a couple other people on here that I recognize, including the people that I'm gonna blow back if I ever run into them at the Smash Brothers Invitational. Um, I don't know who the hell this nigga is, Nintendo Movies. Then again, I, the same could probably be said for me. A lot of people that don't know who I am in the Nintendo sphere either. So I mean, you know what? It, it's equal criticism, you know what I'm saying? I've never heard of this nigga before, though. He's number three, though. I wish I was in the top five, but you know what? Top 10 is fine with me jay wits is up there too look respect goes out to jay wits and um, nintendo life he's a real cool guy too and going further down the list you see a, a couple other familiar heads in here like obi-wan plays is in here nintendo oh this, this nigga who the fuck is nintendo enthusiast you niggas stole my logo bro i'm about to hit them with a quick ass youtube copyright claim <laughs> i'm kidding no but congratulations to everyone who made the list it's kind of cool to see but I think it's a little bit inaccurate, aren't there a lot of other channels which are a lot bigger that cover Nintendo games and stuff? Like, what about that nigga more Ali A, or Munching Orange, or Kabanamani 456? That niggas all cover games too that are based in Nintendo stuff, and they got clear over a million subscribers. I don't know if this list is too accurate. What kind, what kind of criteria y'all trying to talk about here, you know? Like, I guess they mean, like, general Nintendo guys who will talk about whatever the hell comes up, and maybe they those other guys don't fall into it, but I mean... You know, I, I don't think it was looking at everything as a whole. But yeah, outside of that, they got everybody that matters, you know? You, there, there's some people that you just don't need to concern yourselves with remembering, you know? Because they, they feel as if they'll be able to make an impact in some form or fashion at a tournament. And you, you, you got to sometimes remind them that, you know, that's not possible. So, you know, yes, let them stay out of the picture, man. Um, congratulations to everyone who made the list. And, uh, you know, keep up the good work, guys. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see y'all niggas later because I was only here to talk about the porn star on the Nintendo Switch game that I'm going to be streaming later on a live stream. So, I mean, whatever. <laughs>